Hi, my name is Anisha Rigmi. I'm from Kathmandu, Nepal, and I study MA English at City University of London. Moving abroad where the culture is so different uh, from my own is a very challenging thing to do. The most difficult part for me was leaving my family and friends back home and taking off on my own. Um, the education system was also vastly different, so there were times when I had to get used to the university life here in London, um, but I wouldn't trade it for anything else. As much as we all love academic validation, um, it takes so much more to be a part of the society that we live in. Um, it takes social skills, open-mindedness, and um, the discipline to do so. And um, City has taught me about diversity, equality, taking care of the environment, and so much more that I think I've become a more mature and an understanding person overall. The reason I chose to come to London is because of the career school. And also, UK is one of the top destinations for studying abroad for a reason. It has a lot of opportunities when trying to venture out um, in the professional field as well. City is very accommodating to international students. Um, it offers so many scholarship schemes, loans and bursaries. Um, to the students that are already enrolled, um, it has free counselling opportunities and such. Um, there are also many events organised to help the international students feel more comfortable during their time at the university. And everybody is so nice and professional as well. The education system in Nepal and the UK is very different, so I wished um, I'd have been aware of how many changes I had to face before being used to the student life here in London. Um, just the different coursework and teaching methods in general. First and foremost, be prepared to undertake a load of work. Um, please maintain a healthy student life and a personal life. Um, City is a great university and help is around every corner. Um, please take care of your health and most importantly, I cannot stress this enough, don't fall behind on your assignments. So that is it. Thank you so much.